got you. I got you. Three, two, one. Yep. Nice. Keep going. Good. Keep going. Is that enough? Keep going. Five. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Six. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. One more. One more. <laughs> welcome, welcome to the party. Welcome to Gold Gym, Venice. I found my, my back. Please pause. I always say found my back sticks to it. Come on. <laughs> Don't worry about counting. Get that breath. Let's go. Get that breath. Three, two, one. <clears throat> one. Go again. Go. Go again. Go again. <laughs> Hold it there, hold it there, hold it there, hold it there. Hold down, roll down, reverse. Reverse. Pounds, 40 something kilos, or it's confusing because back home in New Zealand we work in kgs, kilos. So when everything's yeah. transitioned to pounds, it's like you gotta get your calculator out. It's very different because uh, normally for me, I just work with the oh, yeah, the heaviest weight. We just, <laughs> yeah, that way you don't have to count kilos or pounds, you just do it. But one of the questions was. Uh, why, why ones? Tell me why you warm up with more reps. I usually warm up with more reps um, with a lighter weight, maybe going 15, 20, to kind of pump the blood into the muscle. Okay. Um, that was my kind of theory behind it. Okay. And how does that feel when you get into the workout? You like that, right? You like the blood in the muscle. I do, but then okay. I also don't want to go too much okay. to take away the energy from the actual workout. Okay. Mm. Nice. Nice. Yeah, that's... That is your theory behind the one. I don't care about blood and the muscle. I care about the nervous system being woken up. Yep. The nervous system is the weight. Yep. Um, and by giving out so much energy on the warm ups, when I get to something that's like even relevant, you know, any kind of real weight, I'm already fatigued if I do it like, like we used to do. It. I mean, yeah. there's no difference. I, when I first started, of course, I'd pump up because I thought blood and the muscle is the greatest thing in the world. And it took forever for me to realize that it has nothing to do with blood and the muscle. It has everything to do with the nervous system waking up, pushing as much weight as I can for the real sets. Um, because the main, the main core for me is if I can stay injury free, if I can continue to get better and stronger, muscle grows. It's a side effect. Um, but everybody, uh, and, and again, it's not bad. It's a great way to do it. And it, it feels great. And it feels great mentally the way you do it. And how we used to do it is get the blood in the muscle. I just realized that it took away from the real sets for me. Yeah, it makes complete sense. I, I can see that. Yeah. So get in, hit it uh, on the important stuff, and get out. But I, I like watching you how you do this. You go a lot of uh, elbows out when you're benching. Yeah. And you like that? I do. Yeah. But. But I find if I flare, like, if I tuck my elbows too much, my triceps take over. Okay. But again, if I flare them too much, my shoulders take over. Um, so I kind of just try and find that <laughs> that perfect point. <laughs> that fine tune it right yeah. in between. So guys, just for you guys at home, which is better? They're both great. Try them both. Uh, there's no difference here. He's got a great physique, as you can see. So whatever you're doing is working. Let's Thank go. <laughs> Kill. Throw one up. Up. Yeah. One, two, three, go. Oh. 
Caring training partner, I like that. Set the number. Set the number. Here we go. Drop, drop. One set uh, of something real. Um, so to hit 15s all the way up, you're not going to be able to make those reaches, those numbers. Yeah. As much as like what we'll do is we'll keep the, the reps at one to five or whatever that is until we get to a real weight, and then we'll hit 15 reps there. Yeah. That's our goal. But you're hitting four sets, so it's completely different. You got. I hope you guys understand that. So like when I finish my workout today. I maybe have five sets in uh, to the most, where he's gonna have almost 20 working sets in to my five sets. So it's a huge difference. So he's gotta save even more energy. Um, and that's the weight change, the weight yeah. change. That's the biggest thing. And that works for you. So if it works for you, don't run away from it. Don't run away from that stuff. But again, it is always good to Try something new. Oh, 100%. 100%. Yeah. But not when you're in the mix. <laughs> not when you're in the fight. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> it's all right, kiddo. Yeah. 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 Let's go. Start a day. My fault. A little late. A little late. <laughs> I got it all the old time. Look how jacked he is right now. Uh, feel good? Feel good, yeah. Good pump going. Um, different style of training. So I can tell um, it's hitting my muscle in a way that I usually train. So yeah, it's feeling good. How's it different? Um, Just so I feel like more deep stress, if that makes sense. Yeah. I didn't tell him to say that. <laughs> I didn't tell him to say that. So, yeah, I don't know how to explain it, but it just feels it's, a it's deep the, It's tearing the fibers. Yeah. And I know society loves the pump. And I understand the pump. It feels great, but as soon as you leave the gym... For example, I could bring you in here, we could do a 20-minute workout. And we got a pizza last night, and I could fill you up on some creatine and, and bring you in here and superset you. You cannot lift your arm. You're so pumped up, your chest is filled. To society, that's a great workout. You sweated. You didn't rest. And you move through it. That's not actually what you want. What you want is the tear of the fibers. Yeah, now, if you can get that as you go fast, that's great too. Um, but I'm glad you said it. Stranger's like, she wants over here. She wants some of this. <laughs> so, like he said, man, it's, it's the tear of the fibers. When people say I lift heavy, I do lift heavy. But I lift heavy with one rep and I lift heavy to 20 reps. With the heaviest weight during that exercise. Yeah. 
So I like it. Gold's Gym, Venice, ready to go, ready to go. different than real life. I'm old school, so it's a nice rawness to this. Yeah. But uh, you're a pup, you're gonna learn so much through this, and then you got such a great following, and you collab with some great people. Uh, this is your future, baby. This is you. I love it. <laughs> I'm doing what I love, so that's the best part of it. Everything you got, everything you got, let's go. Thank you. 